Your certified most accurate four zone weather with meteorologist Jeanette Kaye. Hot and humid seems to be the uh, uh, going rate these days, yes? <laughs> yes, and even hotter today. It is today. May though, right? I mean, that's, that's sort of standard. Even hotter okay. today <laughs> than where we were yesterday, but the good news is today, tomorrow, and then that's it. Cool It'll get cooler. 80 degrees for the rest of the summer. Yeah. Oh, that would be nice. Can you imagine? <laughs> All right. Here is what it looks like outside right now. Raul B. Rodriguez Law Weather Camera. There's a little fog, as you can see in the distance of downtown San Antonio. 76 degrees and cloudy with fog and mist in parts of the area. South southeast wind at 11 miles an hour. Air temperature near the dew point temperature. So the atmosphere is super saturated. Relative humidity at 94%. Watch for fog mainly over western Bear County up into the western zone and west of uh, Bear County and San Antonio westbound along Highway 90. This is where you are going to notice some lower visibility and we're going to see more fog uh, developing and we'll have the fog until about 8 9 o'clock this morning. Temperatures are warm 70s and mid to upper 70s in parts of the area 79 in Catula 77 in Carrizo Springs. Notice the cloud cover that continues to, to move into the region far the north, it is clear from near Dallas back towards Amarillo, Lubbock, including El Paso, but the cloud streaming from the southwest towards the northeast here. Uh, we're seeing rain and snow, heavy snow across Montana, some of that getting into Wyoming, showers moving off towards the northeast, thunderstorms yesterday wreaked havoc around Ohio, tornadoes reported in Ohio. Uh, there is the potential for more stormy weather today, however, it may not be as bad as the last couple days in the Midwest and and the Plain States. Tomorrow, though, we're expecting another round of severe weather. All right, uh, as we go through the afternoon, gradually clearing out some, becoming partly sunny. There could be an isolated thunderstorm around portions of Kendall County, Comal County. Uh, tomorrow in the morning, once again cloudy, but in the afternoon, partly to mostly sunny. A cool front drops south tomorrow late evening, and that could trigger a couple of thunderstorms, especially across the hill country and down into northern Bear County. Behind the front, winds turn around to the north, and that's what's going to bring in the cooler, less humid air. Here's the severe storm outlook for today. This is just a heads up that there could be a strong to severe thunderstorm anywhere from Canyon Lake to San Marcos. Slight risk, though, farther north into Austin. Tomorrow, with the front, a marginal to slight risk for isolated to scattered strong to severe thunderstorms. This is where we have to watch storms that could produce some high winds and hail, and that will be tomorrow in the evening. Austin on north, there's an enhanced risk for severe thunderstorms. That's where more numerous severe thunderstorms are likely with large hail, maybe even an isolated tornado. It's going to get active again Mother's Day Sunday into early next week as this upper level disturbance swings across the state, but the center of it will miss us to the north. Here's a look at your extended forecast going up to 95 today. Heat index near 100 tomorrow. Slight storm chance late 82 Friday Mother's Day weekend. More clouds, 30 percent rain chance Mother's Day Sunday and next Monday. Here's the extended forecast for the other three zones. Be careful if you have outdoor plans today. It's going to get pretty uh, hot out there. That's a look at your four zone weather. We'll be right back after this short break. Stay with us.